Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life. Well, it's good to see you all again. Here I am with John Coleman, my partner in crime and co-founder of Celebrating Act 2. And, and here uh, I am with Art Kirsch. That Art Kirsch guy. Yeah, hey, that's Art. me. How you doing, John? <laughs> It's time for our weekly Founders Vlog where we discuss the really important things in life. Like? Like, for instance, holidays. Bach humbug. Bach, <laughs> Bach humbug to you. I know you're a holiday guy. You're just yes, not it's... big on religious holidays. Right. You prefer, well, I you like the family. Festivals. I'm a family guy. I'm a family you're guy. A fa family get togethers. Welcome. You love the get-togethers. You just don't do that worship thing. Uh, I I worship uh, the time that I spend with you. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Yeah. So we're look. We're in the middle of the holiday season. Um, no, 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 no. Halloween. No, no. Halloween for me. Halloween starts the uh, holidays, right? And it goes through New Year's. Okay, I'll buy that. Uh, I don't. And, and we're two weeks out from uh, Thanksgiving. Mm -hmm. After Thanksgiving starts uh, uh, Hanukkah. Hanukkah is early this year. Yeah. Then there's Christmas. And somewhere in here, maybe it already passed, is uh, the Muslim holiday of Eid. Do I have that right? Uh, uh, Ramadan. Ramadan, Ramadan and Eid. Okay. I, all I know is Halloween to New Year's, holiday season. Well, actually, and we're going to we're going to get all the advertising, all the holiday advertising. I just saw the other day. I saw an ad on television for a whiskey. I think it was, which I thought was very unusual. But only the the hard liquor people only advertise, at least used to only advertise, at Christmas at, at New Year's time, really. Yeah, well, you know, now uh, this is the time of year that they start having all those uh, 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 perfume ads like with Charles Bronson, special, uh, uh, the good, the bad, and the ugly uh, aromas yes. and all those things. Yes. I do agree. But you know something? It's it's uh, the a week ago today, exactly a week ago today, we were chatting about something about, you know, do the holidays ever end? Uh because they seem to start <laughs> earlier and earlier. And I said, yes, you know, pretty soon, and I, I was uh, at a location, I was going to be heading home soon. I said, pretty soon they're going to be heading up. I live in uh, 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 Mission Viejo, Southern California. So pretty soon I'm going to be driving up a certain street and uh, they're going to be, the trucks are going to be out with these cherry pickers up and they're going to be putting decorations on the tree, uh, uh, holiday uh, de decorations. And then uh, sure enough, Right after a phone call, I think we were actually talking while I was driving, and I turned the corner, and sure enough, they were they putting saying the beginning up. of November. Okay, yeah. it barely got, the barely the name November, the letters were barely dry from being printed on the calendar. <laughs> and so it seems like almost holidays never end. Yeah, they, it does seem that way, but they, I think the holiday season is relegated to the fall. Now, I don't know why, because... There's plenty of other holidays during the year, but mm -hmm. maybe they're just not jammed together. By the way, I love your new look with only one earbud. Yeah, but <laughs> at least they both work, so we'll have to talk about technology someday. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we saw your other one fall out. I loved it. Right. Well, that, Very... was, that was some of my gray matter. <laughs> <laughs> so, so is it because... All these holidays are jammed so close together, literally in within two months. Well, you forgot a couple of really special ones to me. There's yeah. Veterans Day and Marine Corps birthday, which is coming up okay. shortly. And of course, two of your favorites, okay? Uh, Kwanzaa and Festivus. Okay, okay which I think, uh, and, the, and then isn't there like a 12 day of, Christmas thing after that goes past New Year's. If you yeah, if you recognize that at the twelve days of Christmas is Christmas Day to um, the Epiphany, which is November. No, it's January sixth. Right. And so a lot of a lot of people celebrate those twelve days, and they really wait and they give a gift every day, and then 
really January 6th is there. My mother used to call it Little Christmas. That was, for some people, that's the gift-giving day. Right. It starts on Christmas Day. Okay, and, and really the, odd, the oddball is like Easter. Yeah, which, now, see, which now is outside, Easter, it's, 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 it's Easter outside. somewhere in April. Yeah, right? so that's the oddball. And so that's not, it's like far enough away that it doesn't count as part of the holiday season. Right. So I think that for me, the holiday season, I don't care what religion you are or aren't, is uh, family get-togethers. And we have a massive numbers of them, at least three or four, uh, maybe the smallest being uh, nine or ten when it's just our immediate family to an extended with my sister and her family and other right. people. That might be 20 or 25 people. And it's right. wonderful that we have all these kind of holidays. And also because... There are so many different religions blended in our family. Uh, I remember one of the fondest days that we had was uh, around Christmas time. Uh, they call it an uh, elephant gift giving or something where people steal gifts. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, I, I, something like that. Right. So uh, I, and that was uh, done at my uh, in-laws, uh, uh, my uh, uh, oldest daughter's uh, in-laws who had eight children. So they always <laughs> had like, you know. Uh, an army. It was a conscription day if the government <laughs> wanted to fill up a platoon yeah. uh, of people come yeah. and we'd steal each other's uh, uh, presents. Uh, yeah. So, I mean, it's. I think it's great family time. Yeah, it is. And I think that's probably the most important. Well, uh, unless you're <coughs> really religious and you're celebrating that, but it's, it, it's the important part is the getting the family together to to celebrate the same issue, the same holiday, um, but you can do that on 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 birthdays, and you, it's not quite the same as the July Fourth, um, you know, barbecue or something like that. Right. But all of those holidays, bringing family together and friends, not right. just family. Uh, my daughter always invites friends to uh, Thanksgiving dinner and Christmas dinner, so you know it's a it's a pretty big. Table. Yeah, but but it, I don't even care when you were born. Uh, as a matter of fact, our our family has a, a special get together uh, every su summer called the summer birthday parties for all the kids who were robbed of the opportunity of having cupcakes in school because they were born in July and August. So that yeah. sometimes becomes uh, our big uh, uh, summer get together. Uh, but uh, the thing I find kind of hokey about this whole thing is that there are stores that now seem to be Halloween stores and then right. uh, uh, just Christmas supply stores. Some of them are open, if not year round, half the year. You know, I, I, we've got one near us and I noticed <laughs> it, it was an empty store. I don't know what it used to be, but it was a big empty warehouse kind of store. And about two months ago, it became the Halloween store. Right. We have a, a boot barn, an and old boot barn. I guarantee yeah. you this week it's going to switch over to become the Thanksgiving Christmas store. Right. You know. But anyway, it just so. seems like that, uh, especially for uh, I, I, Christmas is where they, most of the really big decorations have come up uh, yeah. over the years and uh, in every community throughout the U.S. just about. And they just, the lights go up like November, just about November yep. 1st. In fact, I think that was the day that we spoke and I was driving past and uh, they were, they were uh, twirling the trees with the white sure. flickering lights and, uh, and so on and so forth. And then there'll be uh, 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 down in the, in the uh, uh, politically fought over common area, which I think they gave over to uh, a nonprofit. There'll be a... Uh, a crash and a Hanukkah menorah and uh, whatever else uh, uh, somebody came up with that they decided they had to have there. So, yeah. but th those are going up now. Okay. Oh, and I, I think they're already eight weeks. up. I just haven't, I yeah. haven't passed by any, but I think right. they're already up because the, you know, it's part of it is the, the city puts that stuff up and they have to schedule their crews sure. who are, you know, they don't want to pay overtime. So they got to schedule their crews got to get it up ahead of time there's uh, you know 20 miles of streets yeah but time. what i'm talking about is that it's become so hallmarkishy as opposed to uh it just uh, when i was growing up uh back in the dark ages before they had color tv and um 
uh, uh, iPhones and the like. Yeah. Uh, smartphones. I, we we we're looking for advertisers. So smartphone. So Samsung. Oh, do you hear thank us? Thank you. <laughs> but um, I remember that uh, that stuff didn't happen until after Thanksgiving. After Thanksgiving seemed to be the place where it it uh, uh, that that mark when they would start doing decorations. No, I, I remember it differently. I remember that the retailers always rushed uh, yeah. the Christmas holidays. Before Thanksgiving, it was always after Halloween. Yeah, but I think and I think one thing that we can both agree on is that uh, it is uh, whether it's uh, more, as I say, home orchestry, or whether uh, it's earlier or later, it's still the family get-togethers that are the richness that I enjoy and that you enjoy. And you know what? I think that's why uh, everybody likes the fall holiday season from. Mm -hmm. Halloween to New Year's because there's so many opportunities to get family together. Right. You know, and you don't always see them the rest of the year. Yep. So happy holidays. Well, Halloween is past. Happy Thanksgiving, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, Christmas. Christmas. Merry, no, yeah. not happy Christmas. New Year's. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Thank you. Right. Happy Hanukkah. Okay. Uh, and thank you. And of course, Festivus and uh, uh, Kwanzaa. We don't want to. And also, uh, let's let's give a let's give a shout out for Greek Orthodox Easter, which is a different day. Okay. Altogether. Okay. Did we miss anybody? I don't want to miss anybody. Uh, we probably have offended just people by being here. So, I, I think we've done what? our. We our digit. I think there's a. Hindu festival that we just missed. Okay. Seriously. Well, look at that. I, I don't know what about it, what it is. So we'll worry about that next time. Okay, great. All right. Anyway, whatever you celebrate, nice... celebrate it with family and uh, uh, health right. and uh, prosperity and to everybody. And enjoy the holiday. Yeah. Enjoy the holiday. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube. And tell your friends, Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life.